The kickoff unit is out on the field, and they will send this one away. Returning from his end zone is Ray Ray McLeod. The Steeler offense here about ready for their next drive. And the interception thrown in the red zone last time. We'll see if they can rebound. I just have to think the last thing he... Oh, that's into double coverage and intercepted. Picked off by Marshawn Lattimore. And the return stops at the 39-yard line. Oh, Brandon, this is a veteran quarterback back there. He should know better than to make a throw like this. This is definitely not his best ball. And I think he knew this was trouble the second it was leaving his hand. And they will only muster a yard here to the 38. Here's second and nine, just a yard on that last run. Brings up second and nine. From the gun, Winston. And he'll get this one underneath to Kamara. They find some open field here. And they'll wind up getting this one all the way down inside the 20. 22 yards on the catch and run, a first down. A handoff, it's Mark Ingram. And they get to him quickly here as he stopped right around the 13. A short gain of just over two yards as the first half clock dips inside of three minutes. And the last run got three, now here's second and seven. Jameis to throw it. They'll set up the screen now to Kamara. And inside the five here before he's out of bounds right at the three. The Saints passing game in sync and moving the football. It's a first down. They don't need to run another play here before the two-minute warning. Let's see if they do it anyway. Two minutes on the clock, second quarter, 7-0 ball game. Try to pound it in, Kamara. And this is going to result in losing yardage. They're driven back to the eight-yard line. That's going to go as a loss of four, and it'll be second down. That's a really alert defense there because they saw the heavy look come in from the offense, countered it with extra linebackers who brought a little bit of speed and heft, and able to really make a big-time play for their defense. Oh, a good move at the five. Touchdown, Saints! Alvin Kamara from eight yards out. And the Saints now at six to their lead. CD for them. This has just been an offensive explosion here in the second quarter. Yeah, he helped score us in the first quarter. Now they find the end zone again here in the second. Sometimes you just have to have some patience. A lot of people think it's always an adjustment. You have to change what you're doing. Sometimes you just have to do your game plan just a little bit better. And I think that's part of what we're seeing here. Returning from his end zone is Ray Ray McLeod. The football will come out to the 25 as McLeod will not return it. The Steeler offense here about ready for their next drive. And it's been a miserable start for them offensively. Obviously, two drives, two interceptions. And this is where you have to know your quarterback. And Big Ben intercepted a third time. Picked off by Malcolm Jenkins. And he'll bring this one back to the 29. Three first-half interceptions now, and Charles, you'd have to think a fair amount of concern is developing over there on that sideline. And there should be, because essentially, he's been a little loose and possibly reckless with the football here in the first half. Now, maybe it's not all on him, but still, three interceptions. That puts the entire team in jeopardy. So, the play caller from here on out, got to design some throws for him that he can complete, keep it away from the defense, and try and get him back on track. Oh, ladies and gentlemen. 
And he is into the end zone. Touchdown, New Orleans. Alvin Kamara with his second touchdown here in this first half. And the Saints are able to strike quickly to add on to their lead. Point after, right down the middle. And that makes the score 21 to zip. The kickoff team on the field now as they will send this one away. This fielded right at the goal line. And no chance to get away as they'll get him down at about the 17-yard line. The Steeler offense here about ready for their next drive as they'll take over with just under a minute left to play until the break. Trying to shake off the interception from the last drive. He'll look to throw. Throwing for his running back, and he's got him complete. And he's got this almost to the 40 before going out. A good pick up there, a 22. From up near the 40 now after the big play to start, here's another first and 10. Now it's Roethlisberger. Finding a safety valve here. That's complete. To throw again on second down. Roethlisberger, he sets the fire deep. That's caught inside the 20. And into the end zone. Touchdown, Pittsburgh. And CD, we have seen some great runs the last few times we've been together, but I think we can at least put this one in our top five. That was a determined gallop there. Yeah, and this is one of the best runs you'll see. A lot of times on these long touchdowns, you'll see he gets into the end zone untouched, but not here. He fought his way through contact, and it barely even registered, and he just continued down the field all the way to the end zone. And the next-gen stat shows us the tale of how much yardage he was able to pick up after the initial contact. Chris Boswell, the kickoff for Pittsburgh. So not much time to speak of remaining in this first half as the kick's away. On the return, Deontay Harris. And able to take it past the 25 and up to the 28-yard line. Getting set for their next drive, the New Orleans offense. And with a two-score lead already, they may just look to get this thing to the locker room. And powering through at the 35. And defensively, they're just looking to keep him contained as they're able to get him down. The Saints going to call the first of their timeouts as they'll stop the clock with 12 seconds to go in this first half. They go play action. Winston. He's going to fire one deep, middle of the field. And that's going to be incomplete. Good effort there, trying to take a shot, but it's third down. Well, you most certainly don't want to go three and out here and give the football right back because your friend, Old Momentum, he's wondering if he should change sidelines about right now. And if you don't convert here, guess what? He's going to make the trek to the opposite side, and all of a sudden, you've got a battle on your hands. And unless this is a quick incompletion, this is likely the last play here of this first half. On third down, here's Kamara. And he slips up past the 45 before being tackled. So we've hit intermission. It's halftime. This is the NFL, and it's a presentation of EA Sports. Both teams going through their final halftime adjustments. We're about ready to get back to football. And to bring you the second half from the Superdome, let's go back to Brandon and Charles. And we welcome you back now. Alongside Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gordon, getting set for quarter number three here. Saints have the lead and set to receive the kick. Here comes Deontay Harris from his end zone. 
And he'll be stopped right around where he would have been had he gone down to a knee, maybe a yard shy of there at the 24. The Saints offense on the field, ready to get their drive started. And they've got the lead, CD. What do you expect from them in the second half? Well, I like what they were able to do on the ground in the first half because they had a lot of success running the ball, and I certainly think we'll see more of that. But I keep an eye on that defense, and I think their coaches up in the box will do the exact same thing. If they start to see one or two guys start to creep towards the line of scrimmage, that'll be licensed to take some shots downfield. Two yards, good enough for a first. Now a handoff to Ingram. And he's across the 43 extra yards to the 43. 134 yards rushing for him now in the ball game. Brings up second and one. Winston to give, it's Kamara. And he'll only get a yard to bring up third and one. The tackle made by Devin Bush. A tenth carry here for Mark Ingram. And he brings this up to the 46. Good enough for the first. All runs on this drive so far. It's first and ten. This is Ingram. And no room to maneuver there. Give him a yard up to the 47. The tackle made by Devin Bush. One yard gain. Brings up second and nine. At the 47. On second down, Ingram. And he'll get this one across midfield and down into Steeler territory. Well, partner, they've been running it well the entire game, and the big guys up front, they're a huge reason why. And now they're reaping the benefits as they continue to open up big holes and gain nice yardage. Oh, this may be a free play for Winston. And this one drops incomplete, but I think the defense jumped. Well, we looked at each other right when he flinched. We knew that that flag was coming. Yeah, offsides, easy call, mark off the five, and keep it moving. An incomplete pass on that last play, and that means they'll need to come up with something here on third down. After the penalty, it's Ingram. And he's taken down at the 43, but not before picking up the first. That's another Saints first down. First down at the 43. Ingram. They're going to snuff this play out behind the line. We have not seen that much today. Two yards the loss, second and 12. It's a loss of two. Brings up second and 12. Now flags will come in. And I think this is against the Saints up front. And that false start penalty is certainly not helping their cause here. Second down and long. They'll try to throw now, Winston. And he rifles one incomplete. Nowadays, quarterbacks don't mind throwing into coverage because of the confidence they have in their receivers to come down with the ball. But sometimes you have to be careful you don't get too confident and throw an interception. Pittsburgh with six defensive backs in the game here on third down. Winston now from the 50. And he'll just toss it away. So he throws it away, and that brings up fourth down. The frustration evident there because he couldn't find anyone on third down, and he left no doubt that he was throwing that one away. And how about this? Fourth and long, and they're going to go for it. Working out of the gun, Winston. And 
It's incomplete. They cannot convert, and they turn it over. A surprising move to go for it predictably, at least somewhat predictably. It doesn't pay off, and this defense will take over right at midfield. So good field position for the Steelers as they come up first and 10 right at the 50-yard line. From midfield now, here's Roethlisberger. He's going to air one out. And his pass is intercepted for the fourth time today. Picked off by the corner, Bradley Roby. And this one will be brought back to the 22. I'll tell you, Brandon, it seems like this guy's been all over the field so far. That's his second interception of the game. And so much of playing defense in the NFL, especially when it comes to defending the pass, is all about positioning and technique. And this is fantastic work on both fronts there. Looking long for Thomas. And that is incomplete. Took a shot there on first down, but he couldn't reel it in. But it's not been the best game for him. But he definitely tried to get by with a little help from his friend there, trying to create a big play. Couldn't do it, fell incomplete. But you're right, hasn't been a banner game here in the second half, just trying to get going. Big thing is trying to keep confidence up and continue to fire. And a great move on the play as he takes this one past the 25. Five yards, now it's third and five. They run it again with Kamara. And he is not going to get the first down as he'll spot this at about the 28. Just a yard on the run there, and that's going to bring us to a fourth down. I'd say they've got to find a way to get him going. He's such a big part of their offense. I wonder if they might throw it a little and come back to the run. Anything, because you're right. He's pretty much been completely neutralized. And that is going to do it for this third quarter of action. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. Well, the offense failed earlier on the previous crack at this, but they're going again on fourth down. Throwing, Winston. He'll find his tight end, it's Adam Troutman. And they get him down, but not before he takes it across the 40-yard line. The conversion is successful with a sizable gain of 13, and the decision to go for it looks like a smart one. This is Ingram on first and 10. And maybe a measure of revenge there. He's had his way in this one, but this time they get him behind the line. He'll lose a yard there, and it's second and 11. At the 41-yard line. From the gun, it's a run for Kamara. Five yards, now it's third and five. Brandon, I've got to think this offensive line has got some smiles on its faces. And, and I know it sounds crazy, but they practiced for this back in training camp. They knew they'd be in situations where it'd be extra defenders in the box coming after them, trying to keep them from locking down a game. Right now, they want to show the world they're up to the challenge. From the shotgun, it's Winston. A hit as he throws there, incomplete. I think he had to unload that one before he wanted to. He was right up in his grill. I think he was a dentist there without a license, don't you? <laughs> Just not enough time for the play to develop. Just lucky it wasn't a fumble, really.
The offense going to stay out there. They've converted once, failed once. What can they do here on fourth down? And here comes throw number one for the backup QB. That is taken in by Hurst. And he goes down, but not before getting this inside the 25. Fourth down conversion plays, you usually think one, two, three yards, maybe 10. Not there. What a huge pickup as the sticks make a drastic shift forward. Now a first down carry. It's Kamara. And just no chance of turning the corner. He can only get back to the line of scrimmage. Second and 10 coming up. This drive's taken more than three minutes off the clock already as they come up on second down. 